Uh, I gotta so stop getting so fucking heated in these. I'm gonna fucking like die to high blood pressure or some shit like that. Hot blooded solar. That's why I just try to have fun. <laughs> yeah, really. uh, that's why I started drinking. I'm loosening up. I might also <laughs> I, I might also open up some interesting strategies. So who knows? Oh boy, here we. Oh no, this is fucking Skyrim. I thought it was Scooby Doo's mansion again. I was about to say, fuck, man. <laughs> Oh hey, God, go star! I'll definitely like. I'm still remembering that. How much is Black? I kind of want to buy Velma because <laughs> she's so funny. I'm so mad to the police car. I haven't um, placed in the. How do you? What, what do you even do with fucking Velma now that you can't call the cops on motherfuckers? Well, oh, they, they changed the. They changed it to the mystery machine. It's not the same. What they changed it from her calling the cops. Yeah, yeah, so like she had this thing where you could like gather evidence on people, and if you gathered enough evidence, you could call the police, and like a little police car would show up on screen and fucking just like take people away. <laughs> oh, that's funny. So, they changed it to a mystery machine because people didn't. Some people didn't like the idea of Velma calling the police on LeBron James because. Of, uh, <laughs> it's hey, a so fucking so video so game. So <laughs> that shit's just funny. It's a fucking funny. video game, Jesus Christ! But, are people but, stupid? But it, the, the fact that it happened is funny. That's what I. That's the problem. <laughs> it is funny because you know LeBron fucking James. Oh, that's not why it's funny. Ow! Jesus. Velma can no longer call the police on LeBron James in his multiverses update. Okay, you know what? Okay, look at the combos that. Need to get the fuck out of the air. Oh, oh yeah, it. she's got a lot of combos, especially because she's an assassin character, so that's like her whole shtick. Oh, yeah, a lot. she is an assassin, considering, you know, everything. Assassins are kind of hard to play. I don't yeah, even play them. They've definitely got like a oh, higher shit. skill cap. Wow, holy shit. Damn the it. Easiest, oh, I think the easiest assassin is Finn. Finn is stupid easy. <laughs> Do what? Finn literally has Jump. like... At least, I don't know if they recently changed him or anything, but like yeah. Finn definitely had one of the fucking lowest skill caps. Oh yeah, because like just he because comboed in everything up B. It was just like, oh, let me just spam the fucking backpack over and over again. Yeah, that shit was funny. Hold this <laughs> ass. No, no. Hold this ass. No, no, it was funny. Solar. Um, me and another friend were actually playing multiverses the other day, and there was a streamer we played against. I was watching her stream no. as we played. Uh, game three went a double iron giant and we made him cry on stream. You made him cry? Hell yeah! Damn! He deserved it for talking shit! Oh, fuck that motherfucker! Take them I mean, L's! I mean, if you take shot about- if you talk shit about iron giant, you're gonna get fucked. Dude, no, but it's because he beat my Batman, he thought he could oh, talk shit. This. I'm I mean, like, hell no! Nah. In general, the iron giant is a fucking underrated masterpiece. No, oh, it's my favorite fucking film, like, ever. It is a it's, fucking oh, yeah. masterclass in cinema. It's a and beautiful anybody, movie, right there. Yeah. Anybody that says otherwise is a virgin and cuck. Yeah. Hold. You know, there was a funny little argument that I, um, had once. Like, I didn't even bother, but, um, what's his name? Oh, oh well, I'm not gonna mention his name, but what he said... Fuck? Why can I move? Oh, <laughs> he said that, well, like, Return to Oz wasn't a good movie because it bombed at the box office, and yet he likes the Iron Giant, which also bombed at the box office. So I'm like... Okay, what's your logic here? Uh, it kind of reminds me of this logic guy who literally weird. told me that the MLP movie sucked, all because the the reviews of it were pretty negative. I pointed out to him, buddy, the reviews were abysmal, but it did what bank the... at the box office. Dude, like, the thing that was abysmal, the thing that irritated me, is that they criticized the movie for having Saturday morning-like cartoon work. Oh, uh, that's so fucking animation, sad. Which is just like... Has it come to a point where people are just accustomed to CGI now? Probably. It shouldn't be the case. Uh, a question, guy. It's it was one of the last on few movies. It was one of the last few movies that. Oh my God! You actually got some fucking kills. Let's go. We're fucking moving mm. up in the world, boys. He's learning. I, I was also going to mention that I pointed out to him. I also pointed out to him, um, buddy. You do realize too that the MLP movie was still being a hit. Around the time that it 2017 was still in theaters. I mean, right? I mean that too. Yeah, like honestly, I had my I had kind of my gripes with it, but most of them kind of just felt like nitpicks, which is more than I can say for the other movie that came out recently. What's which up, was like, mm. 
I, I like I, I will literally die on this hill. Uh, the fucking G four movie is infinitely better than the G five movie. I mean, yeah. The sense of scope, the sense of adventure, the actual like stakes that were at hand, leaps and bounds above really anything would. the G five movie had. I mean, the I liked the G. The only real grip I had with uh, the G four movie was just the headshot guy. I forgot his name. Like oh, was, uh, uh, Grubber. Grubber, yeah. No, he was a yeah. pathetic excuse for that. And he took up so much more screen time than, like, any of the main characters. Like, the oh. other characters were underused, like Applejack and especially Fluttershy, and they didn't make any use of those two. I'm, but I'm, they'll use a lot of screen time for Grubber. Again, I did have a little bit of criticism towards the G5. I felt that the G5 movie had a little bit of flaws, mainly because of the whole, as someone pointed out, she wants the magic back, but the world seems perfectly fine. But other than that, I still found the movie pretty entertaining, but I still enjoyed the um, MLP 2017 because there was a huge stake in the situation. There was still a huge stake in the matter. The question was oh, fucked. golden. Nice. And wow, did you fucking really just school him as LeBron? That must have been a lucky <laughs> shot. Uh, eat my hammer. Oh, shit, shit, shit. No! Nope. Eat my hammer! Oh. You're a piece of shit, Ryza. <laughs> <laughs> What's up, Border Doc? Borderline Watch Inclusion. this. What's up, Doc? You. G5. You in the air, fool. <laughs> Bottom conclusion, G the G4 movie was still pretty good, despite the fact that people were pretty snippy about it. No, like, I think, the worst... No, the fucking excuses that I've seen, like, trying to prove that, like... The G5 movie was better than the G4 movie have been, like, utterly fucking hilarious. Okay, I'm not gonna go that far. No, it's really funny because they'd literally sit there and be like, Oh, the fucking... The G4 movie is actually worse than the G5... Hang on, I have to get the right voice for this. Yeah, no, the G4 are... movie is worse than the G5 movie because in the G4 movie, Twilight gets angry at her friends. And in the G5 That's movie, none of the ponies get mad at each other. Happen. Yeah, None of the like, ponies get mad at each other at G5, therefore the G5 movie is better. Dude, getting uh, angry at friends uh, is a natural thing that happens in our lives. Yes, yeah. and here's the thing Pretty that it just pointed the... out. Ooh. Flew too close to the sun. Yeah, <laughs> also, the it, it needs to be pointed out too that Twilight herself felt immediate regret when she yelled at her friends. And even her friends... Oh, let's go. Like, and even her friends <laughs> giving her. I love even... how angry Bugs Bunny is. Oh my god, that's funny. I mean, it's pretty much in character for him, actually. Yeah, it's fucking duck. shit, Doc. Yeah, <laughs> what? You duck. Yeah, yeah, stop, douche. Dude, I'm, 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 I hope Doc gets it, Doc. Yeah, you are a son of horror, Doc. God damn it. But, um, what was I gonna say? Not to mention, even though that her friends were pissed off at her, they pretty much just gave her space to cool off. Guess what? That fucking happens in real life. What the fuck are these people talking about? And then they he got kidnapped by eco terrorists. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> I mean, that's one way to call Tempest. <laughs> also, right. that's what pretty much made the movie very good as well. Tempest's backstory. Gold, it's time for my seeker weapon. LeBron James. LeBron James. It's called. Oh, a cute and Dan dog. The fuck? All right. Let's oh, do it, guys. Also, I was just a. I was literally just about to be like, oh look, it's Dan Harmon. Just Dan Harmon as himself. I mean, that's literally Rick and Morty. Also, this is Scooby's it. Mansion without a roof, so this one might actually be a little more Iron Giant friendly. We'll see. Yeah. Look how cute he is. He's fluffy. I like that there's, like, need... different glowing colors to indicate who the player is. Yeah, yeah that's pretty nice. Hey, Ryzer, are you gonna call him Danny? Danny! <laughs> He's reincarnated to a new life. Yeah. <laughs> Ow. Whee! I'm sorry. Oh, I'm that's so sad. I should I just want to fix the fucking microphone with this. I'm sorry. Ow. Ow. I don't even know what I did there. Yeah. Oh god, I just summoned me seeks. <laughs> yep. I'm Mr. Meek Seeks, look at me! I wanna fucking die, man! I wanna fucking die! 
Whoa, 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 oh, whoa. Me. I got mixed up with the two. Cause maybe. I can't believe this. Damn it. Wow, that oh. was fucking simultaneous. The complaint, the other complaint that I heard from like critics over the G4 movie was, um, I forgot what his name was, but he used to be part of Spill.com. He basically hated the movie because he watched it at a time when he had a hangover and like was hearing a bunch of girls screaming yeah all the time. So he was miserable in the movie. So he blames the audience for why the movie was bad. Bro, is, what? <sighs> that's fucking stupid. And they're saying, well, that's a pretty bad experience, but that's not an ex like. Like it's I just not want... an excuse, yeah. No, no, yeah, like he argued saying that, well, I didn't have that kind of experience, but it's still not I a can't believe this. Like, that's not even a reason. That's not even a fucking reason. It's sort of similar to how, um, Adam uh -huh. Johnson... Oh. It's like when it's like when Adam Johnson reviewed the movie uh, Promising Young Woman. Not only did he give it a 4 out of 10, but he flat out said he didn't even finish the movie. He's like, I didn't finish the movie, so it gets a 4 out of 10. Don't fuck with Rain he got, a, he got a lot of backlash for that, so he decided to sit down and watch the movie, and he still gave it a 4 out of 10. I mean, at least he finished it that time. Yeah. We're stuck in there That's fair. said a 4 out of 10. He gave it a, a four, 4 out of 10. 4 out of 10. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, let's try you again. Confirm. Oh. I gotta press X instead of A. It's so weird. <laughs> yeah. It's a little strange. Yeah, you, you get used to it. I do agree, it's weird. <sighs> Isn't it possible just to switch that, or is it, like, stuck like that? You I mean, sons I'm of sure bitches! You get to be those characters. Oh, you mean the ones everybody ship them with? Yeah, really? I was I mean, only just referring to just characters to play as, not... I Fuck, know! Justice League themselves was shipping those two, so... <laughs> that's yeah, so that's true. that's what I'm thinking! I personally prefer Batman to be and fair, Wonder Woman. To Bro, my fair, man fucking that. Bats literally shot down Wonder Woman. It's fucking canon that they wanted them two to fuck. Yeah? The writers oh, themselves put it in there. <laughs> I like that pairing so much better than the Superman-Wonder Woman pairing, because that's kind of boring. Yeah, exactly! I like the pairing between Batman and Wonder Woman. And yeah, I know that the comics have, um, did have Bats get with, uh, uh with, um, have Bats date, um, Talia, which led to, led to Damien. But honestly, Wonder Woman with Batman works a lot more better simply because of their um, opposite, the whole opposite rack thing. Hey, Riley. Okay, it's been a while since I played this character, so... It's easy. Ow. Ow. I still, re I still remember that one line Batman says to Wonder Woman when they're talking about relationships. And nope. I think he said, you're a girl from another island and I'm a rich man with issues. Or something along those lines. You're a princess from a dynasty Get of immortal down on the warriors. Platform. Jesus. I'm a rich kid with issues. Yeah, Lots that's of all issues. I... <laughs> I mean, he's not wrong. He's not, but no.